Hello family, uh, this is Eunice Kamunto with Monday Musings. I pray that you're blessed. I pray that you've had a great weekend. And today I just want to talk about how to find your purpose and function in your calling. How to find your purpose and function in your calling. I know that this is a very, very, very interesting topic and many of us have questions, have had questions in the past asking what is my purpose? Why was I created? What does God want me to do in this earth? I myself has had that question many times in the past and eventually I found my answer. I discovered my purpose. I discovered my calling and what God wants me to do in the earth. And uh, I just want to suggest to you that every one of us was created for a purpose. There's a solution that you're supposed to bring in the earth. There's a problem that you're supposed to f solve in the earth. And so it is important that we connect ourselves to that purpose which we were created for. So in this video, I'm going to share with you four tips that can help you find your purpose and function in your calling. So stay with me till the end of the video so that you'll be able to, to learn these four tips. Um, so initially, I'd like to mention that all of us were created for one main purpose. We were all created for God's glory. That's what the Bible says in Isaiah chapter 43 verse 7, that God created us for his glory. So for everything we do, we must remember that God created us for his glory. So personally, oh, for my journey when I was trying to find my purpose, it took me 55 days in isolation with prayer and fasting, seeking God to show me what my purpose was. It wasn't easy. God took me through a lot of breaking and a lot of training, a lot of teaching, a lot of, it took me a lot of soul searching as well for me to be able to discover what my purpose is and to function in my calling. And now I'm so happy uh, sharing, uh, do, sharing with you uh, what God has taught me uh, as I fulfill my purpose, as I, as I function in my calling. I know that God has called me to bring hope to the brokenhearted. I know that God has called me to help people transform pain into purpose through music, through the written and the spoken word. And that is what I am doing right now. And it's very fulfilling. So I want to share with you four tips that you can use to discover your purpose and function in your calling. Are you ready? So tip number one is know that you were created for God's glory. So everything you do, it must bring glory to God for you to, to be able to, to know that it's, it's in accordance with what, uh, in accordance with why God created you. You were created f primarily for the glory of God. Everything you do must bring glory back to him. That's tip number one. And then tip number two, if you would like to find your purpose, if you would like to discover the epic idea that motivated your birth, and if you would like to discover the, the grand reason why you are in this earth, then you must connect back with your manufacturer who is the creator God. You must seek him in prayer. You must fast if you will and find out. So this is the continuation of tip number two. I, I was saying before my son interrupted <laughs> that so uh, you must fast if you will so that God can reveal to you the purpose why he created you. Usually as you are praying and fasting, you will find that God will bring to your heart his purpose his will for your life through this you will start developing a passion towards something you will start having some desires some strong desires some strong feelings some strong passion towards something and that is how you will know that god is answering your prayer and god is directing you towards his purpose his will for you for your life uh, I found that that when I was praying, when I was fasting, uh, when I was searching for my purpose, God started to in, to put in my heart a strong desire for ministry, a strong desire for writing books, a strong desire for music, a strong desire to share with other people that are broken because I was once broken and God heals my broken God healed my brokenness so I started to develop a strong passion towards helping people 
that are also uh, going through brokenness, helping people transform their pain into purpose. So, so we say tip number one is know that you are created for God's glory. Tip number two, pray and fast so that God directs you to your purpose. And then tip number three, always remember that your passion will lead you to your purpose. Your passion will lead you to your purpose. So whenever you start having passion towards something, do not, um, do not shy away from your past passion. Allow your passion to play out and that will lead you to your purpose. And finally, tip number four, which is very important, is live a surrendered life. Surrender yourself to the will of God. Depend on him, rely on him st strongly, because it is only through his power and through his anointing that you'll be able to that you'll be able to carry out your purpose and that you'll be able to function in your calling. So surrender yourself to him. The book of 2 Corinthians chapter 4 verse 7 says that we are just um, fragile clay jars, that our excellence, our power is not of ourselves, but from God. So remember to rely on him, depend on him, trust in him completely and live a surrendered life. Allow him to use you for the purposes why he created you. Allow him to use you so that you can function in the calling that he has for you. I hope that uh, this video can help you, beloved, to find your purpose. Uh, the four tips that I have shared are, know that you are created for the glory of God, pray and fast to discover your purpose. Number three, I said, um, Know that your passion will lead you to your purpose. And then tip number four is live a surrendered life. I pray that you find your purpose. I pray that you're able to function in your calling going forward. Thank you so much for watching. As usual, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos and follow us on the social media pages. Until my next video, stay blessed. Bye-bye. <music>